Good afternoon guys, Seth here. This afternoon, I've got my Echo CS590 Timberwolf with the 24 inch bar out that I did an overlook review on. The other day, I posted a video on as well, me just talking and describing details about the saw, what I like, what I don't like, comparing it to other models that others out there recommend uh, in comparison to this one and just my outlook of it from my experience, uh, why I like this saw. Uh, today we're going to do a demo. I've got a 35 inch piece of poplar um, We're going to make a disc off of as you see here um, With the 24 on the 590 that 24 is a brand new chain It has never seen wood at all and uh, we're going to do a demo test cut and I'm going to show you how it does These saws are a little cold nature.
unfortunately she didn't have much gas in her uh which that was my fault but uh anyways you can see the test cuts that i made through it and uh see the chips as well and you can see how nice it was cutting out but other than that, I mean, this saw does really good, as you can see with the 24. And I mean, for granted, I know this is poplar that it's on. Uh, but it does just as good as well with the sharp chain and red oak. But I did want to say, too, I hope you enjoyed the video um, of my CS590. I know it took a little bit the time talking about it. I know I spent about 10 minutes, and I wanted to do a good demonstration, too, of uh, cutting with it as well. Uh, if you want, I know I said this in the first video of the uh, in-depth talk about it, um, about a 27 being run on a 590. If you want, put in the comments. We would like to put, would like to see the 27 on the 590, and I will put it on and make a video, test cut video, of uh, this saw with a 27 inch bar, but I'm gonna do it with a full skip tooth. Uh, I know I brought that up and a lot of people talk about, will this saw pull a 27? It will, I, like I said, I had tried it a 27 on red oak, uh, but if you're cutting stuff like this with this saw with a 27, just make sure you know your oil is turned up a good bit. And I mean, over other than that, it cuts very similar to the 24 guys. It's just when you're in that big tough stuff, I noticed like elm, red oak, hickory, sweet gum. I noticed it tend to bog a little bit if you had it buried in like a 30 inch red oak that had been sitting out for a year and is pretty well seasoned and gotten dry and hard. Uh, that was the only thing I noticed with this saw and that. Other than that, it felt if you're cutting smaller stuff, it felt very similar to the 24. Uh, that was just a hair bit nose heavier of course but i mean what's to be expected i mean it's four more inches of bar and chain so but yeah if you want to see this saw with the 27 inch bar like i said comment 27 on the 590 and i will put a full skip chain on it and we'll make a video from there if you'd like if you guys would like to see that uh, i know that's something that gets asked a lot online and i hope you enjoyed this video thank you very much for watching comment if you want to see that see this saw with a 27 like share and subscribe thank you guys